then you begin to learn that he has made us unto our God listen kings and priests your priesthood talks of your ministry to God your ministry spiritually that kingly dimension talks of governance and legislature as a priest the jurisdiction is a secret place the place of incense the place of ministry where you send that incense it will rise to heaven the prayers of the saints the intercession fellowship communion koinonia that's priesthood then you take away that priestly regalia and you put on your crown and your signet ring and you hold your scepter and step out that is legislature that is governance everyone must manifest this king priest dimension you are a priest when you come to the house of god you are ministering to god you are offering up worship and intercession for the saints you are advocating for the destinies of men you are communing with god almighty that's priesthood then you take on that regalia of kingship and then you legislate and the bible says where the word of a king is there is please help me where the word of a common man is there is sound but where the word of a king is so i have been made a king and a priest not unto my village unto god and so i can legislate listen the first thing that must begin to change in your life to prove that you are functioning like god is your speech your speech ah we are the weak ones we are the ones who are this and that uh -uh. you know the bible says do not say before an angel i made a mistake your speech it matters are we together your your words begin to be cultured by the word of god you don't speak all kinds of things and invoke woes upon yourself your communications become spiritual bless you good morning sir oh aluta continua victoria is Carter. you are prophesying others are speaking they are not kings but you you have become a believer you have been redeemed yet you are still speaking you have come out of egypt egypt is still in you and now when you speak you are sending sounds to the realm of the spirit and you are programming things they speak and it doesn't happen you speak and it happens the suffering you massage hardship you and pushes you and everything that comes out is your hey why you why are you? this kind of very very unbelief hallelujah you hear a bad report in the name of jesus christ a thousand may fall by my right that's a king speaking ten thousand by my none shall harm me only with my eyes will i see and behold the reward of the wicked ah i will make sure you don't marry and she tells you to your face and you smile a cause causeless shall not stand there is a mystery that no you see all this threat the, the woman said this ah, ah a cause causeless shall not stand are we together yes will you ever finish this house well that started this work is in this in your mind it must be focalized it must be focalized i am the head and not the tail i am above and not beneath the gentiles come to my light lord favor surrounds me like a shield this is a believer talking let me tell you what ordinary people would do the people in our villages know this you see what they do during festivals the major activity in festival is talking and dancing then death follows later on in the evening people start dying because people are talking talking chanting things you are moving around shakata balakata you just sense a presence that is not of god uh, don't sit and say Kai, i'm not sure be sure by praying in tongues start tongues first let let praying in tongues precede you while you are verifying so that should in case you can be praying and hear a shout from another room and say oh i see There are human beings that carry spirits they are innocent they are on the way they are on their way coming to your house to introduce spirits not unwillingly 
but all of a sudden you sense an urge and you begin to pray and they call you and say sorry i just feel like not coming and you know that not only have they revealed something to you they themselves need to be helped you can easily know the spirits that control men by their reaction when you pray because the spirit influences them to act in certain ways that's why many of you when you finish praying in your house that's the day everybody quarrels you i teach you the mystery now the moment you pray agitations from everyone you go you enter your room and the kindest person in your room is attacking you the devil is sending a response if you know you attack him back with joy 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 when you turn to canada don't shout at me yes i'm coming back from koinonia say you claim you are coming back from the church and look at how you match this i'm sorry it's okay you reign you ancient zion's king kadosh kadosh you are mighty on your throne break forth now fountains of the deep and we kadosh so you learn how to speak by faith mark 11 22 23 if thou shalt say give it to us jesus is teaching the disciples how kings speak he's teaching them the language of royalty listen this thing is not just some some you know many believers after working for a while we claim that those who do these things are baby christians it's a joke a principle that jesus himself introduced nothing in your life will ever change until you sustain capacity to command it to he told you has thou commanded thy morning if you don't command it something else will impregnate your morning and jesus answering said unto them have faith in god the correct rendition there is have the faith of god operate like him for verily i say unto you now whoever shall say to what say to what so it is okay to speak to things not just to human beings jesus our high priest spoke to a mountain spoke to a tree who told you they don't hear biology did not teach you that they hear but jesus the spiritual teaches you that they can hear who told you the earth does not hear who told you that when you stand and speak over your family miles and kilometers apart they don't hear so you can stand and begin to legislate they call you at home and they say in the last three days everybody has been sick you say okay i know what to do and sometimes it's not just becoming a priest you jam the door put your crown carry your regalia i send the wind on Aaron. carry the anointing from here to that location you must believe this thing i'm teaching you i'm programming you to be spiritual and how to function like god if thou shalt say unto this mountain be thou removed that means when you speak to things you must be specific specific give us this day what do you want ah, i want i want to do well that's a vague and careless prayer you must call it by name whatsoever adam called that was the name thereof so you name your destiny peace you name your marriage joy are we together you don't turn and say this stupid husband no way my marriage is heaven on earth i call it what it is I refuse to be poor i reject it it doesn't glorify god it doesn't help me fulfill my assignment i decree and declare favor surrounds me if there is a garrison of favor men are coming to bless me today this is a king speaking you are impregnating your morning while others are sleeping you are speaking favor comes in the name of jesus no accidents no nothing I am immune to activities of witches i am above i come from above while you are speaking somebody is sleeping and laughing at you by evening they tell you the person is in the hospital when he comes back home he will never laugh at you again when you are speaking that laughter is a is mockery mockery is initiated by a spirit when jesus wanted to raise the dead and he said the dead was sleeping 
people who were crying turned and started laughing they mocked him and said get out of the house go out get out of the house i want to raise the dead and when he was alone he said little girl talita kumi i say unto you arise are we together yeah when abraham had a conversation and he heard that god was speaking about a child sarah had it and laughed that laugh was sarcasm one of the proofs that somebody has a wicked spirit living in him is how sarcastic he is when believers make faith proclamations over their destiny you see someone while he's jumping his shoe has already caught and you laugh you see that kind of laughter is a spirit it's not just an act it's not just a negative disposition that's why when we say pray and speak and other people stand and they're wondering ah, ah, you mean this is how these people speak that's what that's what brought us here we acted like him in the name of jesus people are blessed tonight the miracle service is a blessing koinonia is a blessing everything flourishes in this ministry because a word waters it words are powerful god rules the earth by the word of his power so you learn the speech of the kingdom you learn how to manifest faith but one of the things that you also learn are the systems of the kingdom i'm teaching you how to be like god let me teach you a deep mystery our time is gone i'll teach you this and then we'll just pray we'll continue next week have you been blessed god never does anything in the bible as a process twice read your bible god's system is to initiate things once and build a system around them for continuity believers hear me i want to teach you how to function like god that's why many businesses fail that's why many people cannot carry out the dominion mandate we'll discuss it next week when we talk of governance he says be fruitful then he says what multiply replenish subdue you can't do those things if you do not understand god's system